Good morning. We are in Greece again, and today we are in the Piraeus port, which is just outside of Athens. We're going to use the hop on, hop off bus to get into Athens city. There's three different hop on, hop off buses, but I think we're going to do the classic, which is the blue bus. And the Acropolis is where we were headed, and they have a new order apparently as of September where you actually have to reserve just time slots. So a lot of explanations, but we'll see how it goes. Here we go. All right, we're off the ship. Now we're gonna go through the cruise terminal and see what that process is all about. Andrea's down there talking to the, the bus lady. I'm on the bus waiting for her. There's our... Uh, Ship. There are two cruise terminals in Piraeus, and unfortunately our Terminal B port was further from the main harbor of Piraeus. But luckily there were buses waiting for us as we got off the cruise ship. The ride into Athens was about 30 to 40 minutes, and there were a few stops before we reached the Acropolis. But this stop was definitely the busiest and the most crowded. So this is the thing. All right, we made it. So we're going to head up all the way up these stairs to head up to the Acropolis. A little bit of a wait. Tickets are done by the, the hour. We just had to wait till our 12 o'clock time frame came up. The rocks are very slippery. Walking up here, very slippery. Check it out. There she is. We're in Athens, Greece. Even though they were currently working on the Parthenon and you could hear machinery in the background, it didn't take away from the beauty of this majestic and very large historical site. It really seemed like the history books and pictures I remember seeing as a young child were coming to life. The whole area was remarkable and beautiful. Look at the city, huh? Holy smokes. The restoration process included strengthening the columns with grout and structural restoration of the capitals and upper drums. On the west side, seven metropes of the monument were transferred to the museum and copies were placed in their original position. And then the more recent renovations involve replacing of the grid frame of the roof on the west wing and arrangements of some of the new coffer slabs. Across from the Parthenon is the Erechtheum and the Temple of Athena Nike. The beautiful Erechtheum was dedicated to both Athena as well as Poseidon and has sculpted female figures on the porch of the Caryatids. The Temple of Athena was dedicated to the Greek goddess of victory and I thought it was appropriate that I pose at the entrance. After running into a few friends, we headed over to one more vantage point from the Acropolis Hill to take in some more views of the old and new Greece. We could have spent more time here admiring all the sights, but the sun was very hot and we decided to make our descent down to the entrance and to continue our exploring of Athens. I think we're heading to the market. 
I'm gonna get something fresh at the Athens open market and check it out. And we think this is the way out. <laughs> And now we're going to buy a postcard. Pretty cool looking market right here. Outdoor market, like trinkets and goods. We're looking, we're looking for the outdoor market where there's food and seafood and stuff like that. But uh, we gotta hit the post office first. We're on a beeline to find the post office. Which way? No, we found a post office. It's right over there. Yeah. Now we're uh, apparently the open market's closed. Uh, open back up again tomorrow, but we won't be here. Now we're just gonna go find a place to get something to eat, and then try to find a bus to bring us back to the port. Wow, really that, good. that looks really good. Really good. Cool. I would have preferred the lamb. Yeah, right. they didn't have lamb, they had pork or chicken. There we go. Oh. Mm. Pretty cool restaurants, outdoor eating. After walking a bit, we jumped back on the hop-on, hop-off bus, saw a few more sights around the city, and then headed back towards the cruise ship. In general, it was a great day, but we were really stressed about being so far from the cruise port and making it back in time, knowing that there was going to be lots of traffic. We made it back home, made it to the port. What time is it? Early. We're like an hour and a half early. <laughs> that was a nervous wreck. That's an understatement. Oh, boy. I just didn't feel comfortable with the bus situation, but we made it home, that's all that matters. Thanks for coming along. <laughs>